Hi, I'm Nathan from the UK Pharmacogenetics and Stratified Medicine Network. This video is going to explain what pharmacogenetics means, what stratified medicine is, and what the network's about. So what is pharmacogenetics? Pharmacogenetics, simply put, is adjusting someone's medication based on their genetic makeup. So historically, six people would go to hospital with the same disease and all be given the same drug. Four of them get better, one of them the drug has no effect, one of them might even have an adverse drug reaction. But now, by sequencing the human genome, we can identify which groups of people are going to be negatively affected by a medication, so we can make sure they don't receive it. We can find out which types of people won't benefit from a medication, so we can try something else with them. And we can see which group of people are going to really benefit from that medication. Why is that important? Well, 6.5% of all NHS hospital admissions are due to a patient suffering an adverse drug reaction from a medicine that they've been prescribed. That equates to a cost of £2 billion a year. Just to put that into some context, that would pay for 10,000 new midwives. So if we can work out in advance which patients are going to have an adverse drug reaction, we can avoid giving them that drug, they can avoid the suffering of the adverse drug reaction, and also we can pass on those cost savings to the NHS. So stratified medicine simply means grouping patients based on their genetic makeup or on the molecular basis of their disease and giving them a treatment that's more tailored to them. Rather than everybody receiving the same treatment, we can identify which groups of people would benefit from which types of treatment. This means that instead of having a trial and error approach, we can give them the right drug at the right dose and in the right combination with their other medications. So what is the UK Pharmacogenetics and Stratified Medicine Network about? There are many academic researchers working to understand the human genome and the molecular basis of various diseases. Clinicians working in the NHS have access to a massive amount of clinical data. We've also got drug companies that are working to produce new drugs or to discover new purposes for existing drugs. But in order for us to achieve the future of stratified medicine and pharmacogenetics, we need these groups to work together. We also need the regulators to be on board to make sure that the drugs are safe and that patients are protected. We also need patients and public to be involved so that they can really get on board with this idea of stratified medicine, that they can understand the benefits to themselves and the benefits to the public at large. The UK Pharmacogenetics and Stratified Medicine Network exists to bring all these various groups together so that they can work as a team with this goal of achieving stratified medicine into the NHS clinics. If you'd like to know more about the UK Pharmacogenetics and Stratified Medicine Network, please visit our website, the address is on screen now. Thank you.